Have you ever seen those paid-to-ride scooters parked on the side streets? Today, we are going to share how to ride this scooter. It's going to be fun. Let's do it. First, scan the QR code found on top of the handle bar using a smartphone. Then, install the app. Next, create your account using either your Google or Apple account. Now, add your credit or debit account for payment method. Voila! Now you are ready to ride! The app will show you the location of the nearest available scooter. Once you found one, it's simple. Just scan the QR code from the app and it will be enabled for you. Use the holder on the handlebar to secure your smartphone because you would need both your hands to ride the scooter safely. So, the ride brake controls the front tire. While, the left hand brake controls the rear tire. Can you see this green lever? This is the throttle for the scooter to move forward. We are almost ready to ride. But first, put your right foot on the front portion of the scooter and then push forward the scooter to release the stand. If you noticed, the left foot should be on the side. This is the best and safe position to prepare yourself to launch. Now we are ready to ride. Remember, with both hands on the handlebar, Use your right thumb to push down the throttle. Give the scooter a little push using your left feet while pressing down on the throttle. To slow down, release the throttle and gently squeeze the brake. Prepare to use your left foot to step on the road when you come to a complete stop. Let's recall. Use your right thumb to push down the throttle, right foot on the scooter and give it a push with your left foot. It's easy, right? Just about anyone can ride the scooter. Now always remember, both hands on the handlebar and be alert with other road users. Once you're done, always a good practice to return the scooter where you found it. Otherwise, you would have to pay extra. We don't want that, do we? Deploy the stand boot, stepping on it and gently pulling back the scooter. Now click and ride on the app and it will calculate the charges based on how long you rose on the scooter. Take a photo of the parked scooter and this will officially end your ride. Hope you will have fun riding the scooter. See ya! Oh, and don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't done so and share with your friends. Bye-bye!